Now to the Eagles and the countdown to Super Bowl 57 in Arizona. Just four days away now and the birds are busy preparing for the game of their lives. Count them on one hand. Yeah. Oh man, back here at home, restaurants and bakeries are getting ready to fulfill a ton of Super Bowl party orders. And one very popular spot is the Conchahokan Italian Bakery, where the biggest seller, the tomato pie. Action News reporter Catherine Scott takes us into the kitchen. Here on Jones Street, Conchahawken Italian Bakery opened in 1973. Tina Gambone explains 80% of their business is wholesale. But my dad built the retail store as a little add-on for the community. Do you want to do the Eagles stencil? So we've kind of expanded over the 50 years. Expanded and became a neighborhood favorite, a staple for holidays, sports, and now the Super Bowl. It's insane. This is probably busier than Christmas. Tiramisu, cannoli, cookies, lots of Eagles delights, but the tomato pies are their signature product. Back in the day when bakeries, our Italian bakeries started, they would use the leftover dough to make pizzas. Now a game day favorite. Once the sauce is spread, the stencils come out. So it's a Philly thing. Customer driven, they try to give the people what they want. Nick Sirianni, Jason Kelsey. Jalen Hurts is a favorite to buy and to make, says Shelby Pascarello. I love doing the Jalen Hurts one. Yeah. I think it's it's just so cool and just the detailed with it. I'm going to put the stencils on top of the tomato pie and we're going to get rocking and rolling with the design and the cheese. It's always about making sure that you cover each and every Letter, most exciting part is taking it off and seeing how nice the stencil came out. And then we add the finishing touches. And there you have it. It's a Philly thing. The orders have been rolling in, so to speak. It's a crunch in these days leading up to the Super Bowl. The Eagles fans are really a fun fan base. So, and when we're good, we're good. The pies are popular. Order soon. Go birds. In Kajahawk and Catherine Scott, Channel 6 Action News.